It's a Boeing 747 engine. When you put into a tractor, the disaster comes. <laughs> so you have to hire the right people. So the people I choose, they have to be optimistic. Because as entrepreneur, if you're not optimistic, you are in trouble. You should have a good IQ at least. Right? If you're not a good IQ, IQ is important. And the next thing is that they are ready to learn. I hate to hire people who came as expert because there's no expert of future. Mm. There's always expert of yesterday. Mm -hmm. We are entering the world. And we don't want people to work, join the company and say, Jack, what do you want me to do? I hate that. <laughs> say, I don't want you to do anything. What you can do for us. This is more uh, what you can do for you. This is this kind of people are ready to learn, fearless for the future, believe in the future, and teamwork, smart enough. Giving them the time, they will come. And then we train them. Make, let them make mistakes. Mm. And I'm telling even now, we have so many people join our company every year. If I got a chance, I tell them, it's not Jack Ma give you the opportunity give you the job. It's you created the opportunity for yourself, for everybody. Mm. And nothing to fear, because we never thought about sneaking from tech. We never thought about doing illegal things. We never thought about, and we're not allowed to do that. What do you fear? Mm. I think young people are the hope. So for me, if I want to keep my hope, I spend time on the young people. Mm. And every young people, I try to tell them life is not easy. I try to tell them that you come here not to work, but to enjoy yourself. You have to enjoy the work you're doing. You have to believe the things you're doing. You have to like the people you're working together. But the other thing is, ask everybody, ask whether young people, old people, ask us three questions. I keep on asking myself these three questions in the past five years. What do you have? What do you want? And what do you will give up? A lot of people don't ask, what do you want to give up? Oh, what do you have? He says, I have nothing. And what do you want? You have a lot of things. And what will you give up? Always think about these questions. And then you will be fearless, you will be optimistic, you will know what you want. And this is where you're going on that, you will never sort of uh, get lost. Wow, thank you, Jack. That's amazing. Thank you. Thank you.